Hell yeah, brother. You're on the Please Me For On YouTube channel. All right, you ready? We're back. We're back. Race number two here in Nashville. Did all right yesterday, you know, held third for most of the race, then got wrecked. So my truck is surprised. But she zip tied, duct taped back together. <laughs> Looks we got, like stitches. Yeah, we got new control arms, we got a new wheel and tire, we got a new shock, so feeling pretty good. And then my truck yesterday was flat sliding a lot, so a lot of these guys are three wheeling out of the turns and mine just kind of wanted to drift. I felt like it was a little stiff. So I asked the guys to loosen up the truck a little bit to try and get it to get up on three wheel. Basically, I just wanted more rear grip. So I didn't feel like I had a lot of rear grip when it came out of the corner. So that could be a combination of me getting in the throttle too early. Not sure. But we're going out today. Because we crashed out and got last yesterday, we're starting on the pole today. So got to maintain position. It's a longer race. Yesterday was eight laps, today's 11. It's a long freaking track, so gotta get out there and do our thing. I know I've got a, a challenge ahead of me, so I know the truck is good, but I gotta really drive the heck out of it to stay ahead of these dudes. They are so fast. Like the winners from yesterday just put like six seconds on the field in a lap. It was crazy. So I gotta, I gotta just hold them off. Okay. You know what you're supposed to do, right? What's that? Don't suck. Yeah, I'm gonna not suck today. <laughs> I sucked yesterday, clearly, by losing, being last place. So, IndyCar is almost done. We're about to go out. That sucker is cooked. Glad I don't have me an IndyCar to destroy, because you already know I would destroy it. So, guys, the goal today is to finish this race. I have never finished a super stadium truck race because I always crash. So today, our goal is to finish. But damn, I love to be on that podium, so let's do our best. power plant inside of them make about 650 horsepower green flag is out 20 inches of travel in the front 26 in the back they are automatics they have the three speed in them and they also have a turning brake robert stout in that red white and blue continental tire lucas oil back machine was the overall winner here one year ago Cleus McFarlane out to an early lead. Bill Hines right there behind him. Bill Hines, a winner back in 2018. Then it's Stanton Barrett. is still out front. Bill Hines in second. Looking for 11 laps here today.
up in the books here. Not much has changed here in the front. The players in the back with this full field inversion have to work their way forward. Cletus out there driving away from Bill Hines right now. Ben Mayer misses it just a little bit. out there driving away and Cletus absolutely a talented race car driver hop behind the wheel of one of these trucks and put it together pretty quickly for sure really good in the brake zones takes that thing really deep down into the brake zones makes it very difficult to pass it caution we were talking about so they'll run the back half of this lap give everything a chance to cool down and Cletus still out front Cletus having a great run one round to go and out front here today flag back out. Now Cletus is going to have some company. The 55 truck of Gavin Harlan leaning all over him. Staying in the draft right here. Shows him the outside. Looks back to the left side. Backs off here. No pressure here for Cletus. Needs to gather it back up. Make sure he makes the turn. Way to the inside. Really lost the arc. That opens up the bottom. Tries to pull it back over. Gavin tried to make a pass. out battled at mid ohio as tight as anybody can race both trucks came back without a scratch he's an extremely talented and clean driver 
does not drive people hard or dirty. And wow, as soon as I say that, absolute chaos ensues between Gavin Harlan and Cletus. I'm not sure who that was behind him. It might have been Ryan Bean. We'd have to go back and take another look. But first thing we want to do is make sure the driver is okay as Cletus is over on his side. Window net coming down. That's a great sign for sure. And I will tell you, this is a tall, tall dude. a goddamn race. Oh my God. Put your hands together for him, ladies and gentlemen. Cletus McFarland climbing out of the truck. Not how he wanted things to go here today, but has certainly proven he is very capable of driving one of these trucks. Known for the saying, hell yeah, brother, as we go back and look again. And, man, that was a massive hit out of the 55 truck that really started that whole chain reaction. Man, I, I'm just flabbergasted, to be quite honest with you. And Ryan Beat was that third truck in there, had to check up. There they go, there they go. Oh, there it is. The fans go crazy. There a lot of fluid out there underneath the truck as well. Something hanging down on the back. If it's a tube or just a piece of debris. So tough, tough go of it here for Cletus McFarland. Had such a good run one day ago. Ladies and gentlemen, one more time, put your hands together for that guy. He's an incredible promoter. Fabulous race car driver. Tell you what, though, I was in first place when I rolled, so it counts as first. There's oil. This yeah. whole corner is oil. This is all just transmission fluid or something. See that? I thought that was an 11 lap race, not four. <laughs> oh, you got a piece of the logo. How are you feeling? I, I'm, I knew you were safe. It's pretty low speed. It, I mean, you but climbed I was up the wall. I was like, it's the fourth lap. I know, that's like, what I was bumping how are you guys yeah. gonna? How are the guys behind me gonna win on the fourth lap? I just wanted you to just go through that finish line, even if you were last. I know, I, I can't. Finish. One of these days, I'm gonna finish a stadium <laughs> super truck race. I guess it's gonna have to be Bristol. The yeah. sad thing is we're taking my truck to Bristol to test it, so I'm gonna have to borrow someone else's. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. We're out here, got wrecked. I mean, once they hit me from the back, basically picked my back tires up off the ground and like I tried to counter steer mm -hmm. and it just there was wasn't much I could do I want to watch it back but I don't know sucks sucks to end up on your lid my truck is totally destroyed really yes it's cranked oh, which dang. is real sad she's a real beaut shout out to fun haver you know <laughs> my boy Vaughn for at least getting me out here to do this you guys know the deal all their fun haver shirts as part of this weekend for the next week if you buy a fun haver shirt you could get a chance to come out to Bristol and see me finish the stadium super truck race. That's the whole goal for that weekend. <laughs> but I'm definitely bummed. I mean, I was pissed at first, but whatever. Yeah. It's all good, you know? Like, I'm not out here racing for 100 grand. I'm out here racing for fun. Just having a good time with you guys. Sorry we couldn't finish the race. But that's, hey, all that matters is I'm okay. I, I don't have a single injury, so I'm you'll, happy you'll with that. You'll probably need my Tylenol later. No, I actually <laughs> feel kidding. fine. I feel really good, oh, so. Good. Holy shit, guys. Oh my gosh, my truck, <laughs> I'm so sad. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we're here with Gavin and Ryan Beat, <laughs> two drivers who destroyed my beloved pickup today. How, what do you have to say out here today? He looks a little uncomfortable. It wasn't intentional. I know. <laughs> Let me All just right, come I'll, up with some excuses. I didn't want to put him on blast, seriously. You though, turned because, 90 in front of me. I had nowhere to go. So Yeah, right. Lift your monster truck, you. But I came back, and the people were like, who was that? And I actually, Gavin is probably the guy I know the best here, so I know it wasn't intentional. <laughs> like, we hung out last night and stuff. Just happens. Got loose. There's all that oil down there. So, it was a bad deal. I feel really bad. No. Uh, no. Bad. no. <laughs> hey, but 
but he did win. Yeah. Woo! So and I'm, we're I'm really happy. To make up for it. Yeah. There you go. And I even bring my wallet out tonight. <laughs> bringing my ID, and I'm hanging with Gavin, and it's all good. So don't don't be too mean though in the comments, guys. He's, he's fragile. <laughs> <laughs>